it's likely you're going to run into problems like dust, runs, dragging the hose across fresh paint, and so on. The best way to fix it is to just stop, let it dry for a few hours, gently wet sand it, and go at it again. On this panel, which is just a demonstration panel, I gave it one coat of Rust-Oleum and I noticed some dust and some sags across the front. So I let it dry in a warm garage for about three hours. Now we're going to gently wet sand it. To wet sand, you can use a spray bottle like this and get it nice and wet and use a palm sander. We're going to be using 1200 grit. You just wet it down and be very gentle because remember the paint is still soft. And I do have a few drops of uh, soap, like dish soap, in the water. And I'm not going to get it near any edges because it's probably going to mess that up being that the paint is soft. If you choose to wet sand by hand, you'll take a half sheet of paper, and this is a thousand grit, and you'll fold it in three sections, like that. And that'll keep the paper from bunching up on you. And wet it down real good. And you can use a bucket and a rag. Just get it real wet, get the sandpaper wet, and very gently And, and keeping it wet is the key to the paper not sticking like it did right there. And I do have, again, I do have a bit of uh, detergent. And that's cutting it down pretty good, real fast. And that's getting rid of any dust specks that we had. After gently wet sanding, blowing it dry, we can hit it with a tack cloth, just to make sure there's no dust. And go ahead with our painting again. This is a junk panel that was borrowed from a salvage yard to do a demonstration on rust repair. So before painting I did leave some dents in the back and I painted it because I'm going to take it back today just to prevent rust. If you're interested, the paint is Rust-Oleum Satin Black without a hardener and thin with mineral spirits, just enough to get it to spray. 
I hope you enjoyed this video on what to do if things go wrong while painting. And if you did, and you'd like to get my latest videos, don't forget to hit the subscribe button.